Good evening, everyone. Uh, can you hear me all right? Yes. Uh, my name is Elizabeth Warren. I'm an Oceanside resident, 789 Aldea Drive, just down the road from Camp Pendleton's uh, back gate. I am also a candidate for state assembly here in the 76th, so I'm taking an opportunity to actually speak about something that's been sort of debated online among folks that are, are concerned about the area. We had one lady just now talking about concern for the neighborhoods um, with retail um, cannabis establishments. I support our ad hoc committee and the enabling of retail operations for medical cannabis. I think that we have a great opportunity here to provide a model that other cities can de see demonstrates. We, ha we can provide safe access for patients. Um, not everyone can grow their own. I know we have one collective here that is licensed and they are quite overburdened. I know that the couple that runs it have very little free time. They're, they're working very hard to provide patients with the information they need to grow their own. Um, what we might also talk about is CBD, which is a non-psychoactive substance. Um, it's not that easy to extract on your own, so it would be nice for patients to have access to that as well. It's being talked about a lot, and since we're hearing the negatives, I think we should also talk about the positives. As well, we are talking about uh, a little bit about, okay, is it going to draw homeless people? I don't know that medical marijuana being available here um, on the retail level would do that. If we have the banking part covered also, we won't be dealing with bars on the windows and something that looks like a you know eyesore. I would urge you to stay with the work of the ad hoc committee and make it available to medical patients as a start so that we can demonstrate to other cities in the state that it can be done right, safely, and responsibly. Thank you very much. Elizabeth Warren, candidate for Assembly 8076 and resident. Thank you. Thank you.